enjoy coming to Krakow. We came last year to the festival, um, and it's quite amazing to find a festival in a very short space of time that does so much. In one week, you have so many fantastic events. And also, you have a wonderful public, a very young public, who come to these concerts and are really enthusiastic and warm, because the music is not easy. It's often music that uh, people are unfamiliar with. Um, and they really seem to enjoy it. And it's wonderful to be able to examine one composer in each program and explore lots of different pieces by that same composer. Well, I enjoy doing all kinds of music. Um, I've spent many, many years, many happy years in the Opera House at Covent Garden. And I conducted the Met and La Scala all over the place doing opera. Uh, but I also enjoy the whole breadth of symphonic work and coming back to the Sinfonietta to do highly specialized contemporary music also is different again. So all the three different elements, opera, symphonic, classical work, and contemporary music, they all require different uh, techniques and different ideas. Music is at the heart of everything, everything we do. Uh, I mean, as we're talking now, there is music around. There's a drum outside banging away, which is driving me nuts. There are uh, orchestral players out there tootling away and playing. Then I hear the air conditioning, and I hear the projector, and there's somebody else banging outside. And it, so it goes on. So our whole world is noise. And so for me, the most wonderful thing is to go home at the end of the day and have complete silence. In fact, John Cage wrote a piece, four minutes, 33 seconds. The entire piece is nothing but silence. So in a way, I can just kind of play that. There's no noise whatsoever, it's wonderful.